Hey guys, Catherine King here, and we are one week away from the release of the song Paragon, which will be the first of seven new singles to release uh, over the next seven months. And I wanted to come on here and tell you a little bit about that and what's coming. I just wanted to share a little bit about the project, the, the greater picture behind the project and the release of these songs, um, because as you know, if you know anything about me, you know my heart is um, consecration. It's the preparation of the Bride of Christ. It's to encourage the body, not just to worship Him, but to worship Him by becoming living sacrifices, that we would be empty, truly empty of ourselves, which is the message of the gospel, that He can fully indwell, fully inhabit, and He can take full possession of that, which He paid such a high price for. That's you and me. Um, and you probably know that it's been a long time since I released an album. I did release a single called Transformed in January of this year. Um, but my last album project was in 2015 um, under the name Catherine Marquis. So, of course, lots has changed since then. Um, I've had a bit of a rebrand, a uh, new name, return to my maiden name of King. Um, and, uh, of course, new hair. That's getting a lot of traction on social media. <laughs> yep, changed my hair. <laughs> Um, but I just wanted to share with you my heart behind this project, because for me, sharing music with the body of Christ is all about um, that the scripture, the role of the psalmist, speak to one another in psalms, hymns, and spiritual songs, that this would be for the encouragement of the saints, that it would be for the, the consecration of the body of Christ, the purification, the sanctification of you and I, as we lift up our heads and we look for the return of Jesus, um, the the author and finisher of our faith, the prize, the goal, of course, is him. And so this project, uh, I love what's behind this project. And the, the first song, of course, is called Paragon, but the album project will be titled The Paragon. Once we've released all seven, it will be released as a collection called The Paragon. Um, and if you've seen any of my socials, Paragon is a really interesting word because it means the embodiment, the perfect embodiment of a concept which, of course, Jesus is the ultimate paragon because he is the perfect uh, representation of the Father. That's, I love the scripture that says, no one has seen God at any time, but the Son has explained him. He's the radiance of God's glory. And so he is the perfect embodiment of a concept. But a paragon is also a larger than, some say 10 carat, some say 100 carat, perfectly flawless diamond. And it also means a very large, unusually large, perfectly spherical, uh, natural pearl. And this word has been very special to me over the course of my uh, journey with the Lord. Um, he's used it very personally in my life. And so when it came to doing this project um, in this kind of new direction, this relaunch, it seemed like the, the natural choice um, and, and definitely something I felt like the Lord was doing. But I, I really felt like the Lord showed me that each of these songs also carries um, a piece of a message of preparation and sanctification for the body of Christ. And each will be associated with a set of scriptures. And each will be connected to the heart of one of the letters to the seven churches in the book of Revelation. This is what the Lord has shown me. And so each month with the release of each single, um, you'll, you'll see it kind of surrounded on social media by scriptures, by um, anecdotes and by and I will connect each one to what the Lord has shown me. All of this my, being my heart for the consecration of the Bride of Christ that ultimately we would be living that Romans 12 one truth where we are living sacrifices having offered up everything to him that he would truly be able to come and inhabit that we would be totally surrendered to him and that he would have in us his very great reward as he is our very great reward. And I'll just finish this little video message with this. I love the, the kingdom parables and the gospels, but I love specifically how uh, the parable of the treasure in the field is followed by the parable of the pearl of great price. And uh, for me, this is about, you know, the, the treasure hidden in the field. The kingdom of heaven is like a man who finds a treasure hidden in a field. And he goes and sells all that he owns to buy the field. And then, of course, we know the next parable is the kingdom of heaven is like a merchant selling fine pearls, who upon finding the pearl of great price, um, basically sells all that he has to acquire it. And I hear in that, you know, the first being Jesus, who, uh, who finds the treasure hidden in the field, that's us. And he lays everything down. He lays his glory down, sells all that he has to purchase the field. He buys the world. 
and to have the treasure within it, you and I, who call on him by his name. And when we find him, he's that pearl of great price. And we sell everything that we have. We give it all away to attain that pearl of great price. And so I'll leave that with you. I'm excited to start releasing music. So do watch uh, Facebook and Instagram. Check out your digital media platforms. You can pre-save Paragon. There's a link in my bio uh, on Instagram where you can pre-save um, Paragon to your music library and Spotify. And that releases across all platforms on September 19th. And I look forward to sharing that and the rest of these seven songs with you. May we lift up our eyes. Come quickly, Lord. Bless you.